All right, today we're here on the Sea Arc. We're gonna do a short introduction on the Hummingbird Helix 10 Gen 2. This is a brand new and it's the first time I've had the boat out of water. So this, this unit is set at factory default from the Hummingbird factory in Alabama. But I'm gonna set it up, show you a little quick tutorial how to set it up for what I like to do and maybe give you guys some good, good tips. Take the cover off and we'll turn the power on. Let's, let's turn the fish finder on. Like I say, this is the Helix 10 Gen 2 with side imaging, chirp, 2D chirp. We're gonna push exit and that's gonna take us to one of our screens. Here's, here's gonna bring us to the 2D uh, sonar fish finder. And we can change that, we can set things. Let's go to, uh, let's go up here. We're gonna go up here to view. This is gonna take us to down imaging. I like blue or green on down imaging. Uh, if I wanted to change the sensitivity, I'm going to go up here and change the sensitivity. I like to have it around 12. Chart speed, I like to be around 5. And then my down imaging colors, I really like green, so I'm going to change the color. The brown's good. There's, you can see where I can change the colors. Right here's the color I like, I like green, so I'm going to exit out of there. Go back to the menu. This is the side imaging. Uh, blue is really a preferred color for side imaging, but for me, I like, uh, I'm going to drop my sensitivity up to 12. Side imaging range, the further out it goes, the less clarity you're going to have. So, you know, I like to put mine around 90 feet, so I'm going to change it to, I'm going to change it to 90 feet. I got it on both sides, chart speed's five, and then I'm going to go to my color. And I really like this, this brown color. I'm going to exit there go back up here to menu so then I'm gonna get split screens I got the 2d sonar with the side imaging if I wanted to save that I'd put one of these quick reference buttons there's 2d sonar with side imaging 2d sonar you can see it looks like a pretty good sized fish land right there on the side imaging here's one of all three which I'll save I'll make this one of my reference points so I'll click right here so I've saved the shortcut. This is my uh, GPS. Up and down if you want to zoom in, zoom out. And I'll save that as one of my quick reference points. I got a shortcut saved. Then I'm clicking through view. And one of the things I like to have is, is, is I like to have a, a 2D sonar with my GPS, so I'll make that a quick save point as well. So I've got some quick save points. I can go right here to all three, boom. Side imaging, 2D sonar, and down imaging. Or I can go to just the GPS, or if I want to go to the GPS and 2D sonar. But you can make a combination and even set your own uh, shortcuts that you want to do. That's a quick tutorial. Uh, let's go back to the uh, 2D sonar real quick and I'll show you. Uh... We'll get back to the 2D. You can push X in and go back. And let's let's go to menu on it. Sensitivity, uh, ten's good. I like everything at twelve. Auto jigging modes off. Chart speed five. Sonar colors, and I like the colors on there. So um, I'm gonna push exit, and there we go. But if I'm gonna, you know, usually I'm gonna have mine on GPS and uh, 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 2D sonar. Also, at the end of this video, I'm going to put a little quick cheat sheet that gives you some of these little quick tips if you really want to side it in real quick. I'll put that at the end of the video. If anybody's got any questions or comments about the Helix 10, feel free to call me. I, it's, it's an honor to represent Hummingbird uh, out here in the field. Check out hummingbird.com. Go to their website if you got any questions as well. Thank you, guys.